Have you ever thought about starting an online business? But something always held you back, you know, fear, you've never done one before. You don't know how to do any of this. I get it because that's exactly where I was. So you're kind of looking for a blueprint. You know, something that gives you the exact steps. Well, if you've never heard me before, my name is Mark Nelson. I'm a retired teacher. And I tell you, being a teacher is really kind of funny because it's really kind of like what you do in online marketing. And what I mean by that is that there were times that I'm a math teacher. And I taught, I first started out middle school, seventh grade. Uh, then I got moved to eighth grade. Then they moved me into high school. And I got moved to uh, algebra two, always algebra. But I remember Algebra 2, you know, what I did was, and this is what a lot of, what I did when I learned online marketing, what I did was I would take the book home and learn the section I was going to teach the next day. And I'd make notes. And then I'd teach it. And then what I found was the more often I taught it, the more I learned it. Well, if you want to build an online business, it's the same thing. One, you know, you know, you can do different things. You can do affiliate marketing. In fact, that's what I wanted to do first. Um, you can build products, info products. You can join a network marketing company. But I remember when I first talked to somebody, and I don't even know how this happened, but I've worked with them a couple times now. I wanted to become an affiliate marketer. I was teaching. I had summers off. And most teachers would either mow lawns or paint or do construction. I didn't want to do any of that. Uh, so I thought, well, online, as it was exploding, but I can learn this. So I got on a, I believe it was a forum. And I asked a question about affiliate marketing. And a gentleman called me, asked me if I wanted to talk. And I had summers off. So I, and I don't really do that. <laughs> If you had asked me if I wanted to talk, I didn't know who you were, and I thought you're going to try to sell me on something, I'd say no way. But for some reason, I talked to this guy. And I talked about an affiliate marketing. We had a really nice conversation. And he's an affiliate marketer. Extremely good one. And he told me what I needed. Okay, if you're going to be an affiliate marketer, one, you need to find a company that has products. And there's companies out there you can get like uh, Click Funnel, ClickBank. I think, I can't remember what it's called. JVZoo, you know, you can sell other people's products. That's an affiliate. They make the product, you sell it, right? That was an affiliate. But he said, there's a key to it. You need to have a market to sell to. So you have to build an audience. And you, so I had to get online to learn how to do this. And then you need to have probably the best way is to get an email, um, get an email list, get an autoresponder. And he said that, he sells more off his email list than anything else, right? There's this thing for, I can't even remember the saying is, but he sold more off his email list than, I, than anything else. And I had none of this. He says, so that's an affiliate marketer. Now you can be an info product. He says, you're a teacher, so you can go out and make products, right? You, you can learn, you know how to do this. You can go learn something and put together a little product and sell it for $7, $27, $47. But here we go again. You need an audience, All right? I had to build an audience up and an email list. That's what always it came back to. So I had some things to learn. And then he said, or you can join a company that has everything in place, the system in place, the follow-up, and I thought, okay, I want to learn something. So I'm going to join a company. And I joined a greeting card company called Send Out Cards. I had no clue what I was doing. I hadn't done any videos before. I mean, I, I taught, so I, I'd done videos, but nothing on social media. Uh, I didn't have a YouTube channel at that time. I, I had Facebook, but it was just family and friends. I didn't have an audience. But I joined this company called Send Out Cards and I used their system, their structure 
to learn how to build a business. And I kind of became pretty successful. I mean, nothing to write home about. I wasn't going to quit my job to do this, but I learned. All right, I followed Send Out Cards Blueprint. And then things happen in life like they always do. Um, one, I got cancer. I, I'm a colon cancer survivor. Um, and kind of really, I mean, there was a year I didn't do anything. I still sent cars, but I didn't focus on building a business. So then because I got cancer, I tried a, a network marketing company or MLM, whatever you want to call it. I tried it in health and wealth, huge industry. And what I found out was that one, not all companies are transparent. They don't always tell you the truth. And there's always this auto ship, meaning that I had to buy products every month. And because I had to buy these products, I wasn't making any money. Couldn't. Because, I again, it goes back to an audience. I was getting into something brand new. So I stopped that one. And then I went and did another one because I, I wanted to get products. Same thing. The 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 products we would buy, they weren't totally honest with us, weren't organic. They're were always something in there that we didn't like. Uh, so I stopped that one. And I was done. And then this gentleman who I talked about earlier sent me a message as on vacation and said, You should look at this company. You don't have to enroll anybody, you don't have to buy products. And if you wait long enough, you're going to, people are going to help you build a business. And that's what's called by spillover, meaning that if he, I was joined under him as he's building his business, as his business was growing, he would put people on my team. Not he would select my team. It was just how the matrix filled. But the thing was, I knew I was going to try to build a business, but what I looked at was the products. I didn't have to buy them. They're all organic. They were healthy. They had a system in place. It was worldwide 212 countries and all i had to do is share a link they had a system so if you're looking for a blueprint one the first thing is to find what you want to do and then you have to decide and i would suggest defining the company and i'm going to suggest live good that's the company i'm in i'm going to, there's going to be a link below because there's so many people here that teach things you can go learn. There's so really some extremely outstanding marketers. But then you learn their system. You can buy products if you want. You don't have to enroll anybody. If you enroll anybody, you get compensated for it. And that's just how this thing works. So, hey, if you're looking for a blueprint, the blueprint really is simply get in something, learn it, and build it and put blinders on and don't listen to anybody and it might take a while <coughs> excuse me <clears throat> i was holding my phone so i couldn't cover my mouth <laughs> um, but learn i mean that's the thing if you want to be a business owner i mean I, I was in other businesses we had a retail business we had a service master cleaning business and every time you get a new business you have to learn you know some people get in i just had somebody get in get from somebody else uh just say well this thing doesn't work because i got in here and nothing happens well learn go in and learn and i don't mean to say to throw that off to you because it's not that hard to learn build an audience meaning you post three to five pieces of, excuse me maybe three to five pieces of content a week one a day two a day learn how to do a video learn how to build a list learn how to do this if you're serious and you want to make some serious money that's what you need to do. That's your blueprint. But go here. Go start this business. MarksFreeTour.com.